package that Laravel um, requires uh, in order for us to send email with Mailgun. All right. So if I go to the docs real quick here, I'm just going to say Laravel send email. I'll show you right now. There is a package called Guzzle HTTP that we have to require. Okay. So let's do that. Let's um, clear this out real quick. And let's just require composer require is guzzle guzzle http and then guzzle like this all right enter all right cool mine took like about 10 seconds there so now once we have this the next step is to set our view real quick let's go to resources views let's just put some html here and bring some of the variables let's just say h1 and here we're going to put the title let's just say p and here we'll put the content remember these variables are coming from the from this data uh, array here this key right here or these keys okay all right, so let's change this a little bit. Let's say, uh, where are you coming back? Let's just make sure we spell it correctly. Where are you coming back? I was in your neighborhood last time, and I could not find my way back. Hi. Hi. What's up? Let's actually escape that. There we go. Oops, not there here, but there. All right, cool. So I think we are ready to, to send email. Let's go to our enter. And we have this little problem right here. Okay. All right. So I think I had an issue like this one time. And I remembered the way we solved this uh, and the way I solved it was going to and you can probably find a permanent solution for this for the SSL certificate problem if you look at if you get the error and copy and paste it on Google and try to find it I think I solved it like this let me see if I we go to the vendor and we look for that specific specific package let's make sure it's synchronized that is there for us to find it goes all right then let's go to that Gozo. Let's go to source code. And here, let's go to client real quick. And configure defaults. Here, this is where we. So let's turn this off, the verification. And let's make it false. All right, cool. Nothing else that we got to check here real quick. This is a little bit more advanced, guys, so I'm not going to get into detail about this. Um, but I'm just showing you how to connect to an API and send email. There are many drivers out there that you can use with Laravel, okay? Let's make sure that this works now, okay? It looks like it's working. I'm going to go to my email and find to see if I have something there. All right, looks like I got the message. I'm going to show it to you right here. If you can see that, you see that? I just got it right now. It's coming via Mailgun. We got the title there and we got the content. All right? Pretty cool stuff, right? So, we are able to send email with just this driver. Guys, there are many other drivers. You can also use PHP mail function to do this. Mandrill, which is really cool. And if you go back to your mailgun statistics, all right, let's go back here and let's just check the logs. You can see that we have some logs here that you can check. All right, pretty cool stuff. You can even build mailing lists, and we are probably going to create a course on that uh, to have people subscribe to our courses and. Uh, to our uh, websites or applications and then send emails uh, automatic emails all right but on this course we're gonna focus on building the, our application uh, which is not a mailing application but but anyway routes uh, tracking right here tracking you can see some information 
all right so anyway thank you so much for watching guys and i'll see you in the next lectures